All right, so we got Zelda Tears of the Kingdom best highlights and builds here to video. Jacoby was trying to use auto build to pick apples. Jacoby, that's a nice name. He used auto builds to do what? If you guys hear a dog, by the way, make sure you guys ignore that for me, please. That's actually pretty convenient, I can't lie. Wow. Damn it. Oh my god. Hi, my name is Shot Don, the top and back to top gaming, gaming place. place. Don't forget Episode to like 69. Video and submit your clips using the link in the description. But let's get into it. Here we go. Let's Two go. wheel motorbikes are boring, so Bear Overlord made one with 18 wheels. Okay. Whoa. 18 wheeler? Okay. That's nice. I like that. Bear. A bear overload. I never. Okay. But 18 was as long as like his as long as uh, Link's heart. This moment that he knew. Oh no! What happened? He What's going on? <laughs> Kick that man like an Adam Vinatieri football field goal. So if you missed the last episode, firstly, how dare you? Secondly, quantum linking. You may have missed that quantum linking is back and it's easier than ever. The new process is called stake nudging and I'll include some links to resources in the description below. Stake nudging works in 1.2 and is genuinely revolutionizing the kind of things we can now build. Raw meat? For example, take fuse it or lose it stakes on a plane. Quantum linking oh, wait, via what? stake nudging allows you to easily create invisible connections. Okay, no, that's items, crazy. He made he made a whole He's been made a whole invention out of meat. That's pretty insane. I, I, I can't lie. Take credit for this pun, but Kevin on Reddit called this steak nudging. Kevin, steak you should be doing my nudging. Job. Shout out to Kevin. Wow, that's crazy though. I can't lie. It's like an invisible like link. Next, I like that. I'd like to see this flowing over lava. Oh, over lava so it can cook. Okay, that's okay. Dom thinks he's smart. Okay, he's yeah, not. Steak nudging is being used to create I'm joking. floating, Love rotating you, Dom. beam emitters. Ooh, aimbot. Aimbot. Sizzle. Oh my God, bro! They're all getting lit up. No, bro, that man just, <laughs> he did a straight drive-by, bro. Bro, he literally has six shooters, bro. Man got a straight drive-by shooter, bro. Uh-oh. War crime of the day. Uh -oh. secret and more unethical division of the Korok space program. This is Zero's latest prototype craft tested on a poor NPC. Sorry for the poor quality on this clip, y'all. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, you're stuck, buddy. You're stuck. You're stuck. Got him. Bro! Time for the prestigious Hello? build of the day award. Build of the day, let's see. Random Pilots has built a magic Korok school bus, and today's field trip takes place in the ocean. Okay. What is this, like a submarine thing? Or like a little hovercraft thing? Again, guys, if you hear barking, I'm sorry about that, y'all. I think I think my mic is on low, so I don't think you guys can hear it, but um, if you guys do hear it, my bad. Sorry about it. Last episode, I showed you Lord Robertus' multi-stage rocket, but as a proof of concept, it had some flaws. But this community, being as amazing as it is, has picked up the concept and ran with it. Bro, look how many fans is on there, bro. Expiring battery to separate the stages, but he's angled his wing for a cleaner release. Bro. Ooh, 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 ooh. Nice. Perfect, but the I, mean, I mean, it's not perfect, but like, it, it, he did good, though. Wow. Two sees the addition of a stabilizer to the wing. Listen to that glue stretch on separation. Ooh, I heard it. I heard it. Bro. They be really in real life engineers making stuff like this, bro. I feel like this should be like one really big, 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 big like contest. Shoot for efficiency instead of aesthetics. That man's really soaring, bro. Stack of fans beneath the wing. That man is soaring, bro. Okay. Let go. Yep. 
Oh no, oh no, it's leaning, it's leaning, it's leaning. It's leaning. Nice, let's go. And Steak Nudging yes. arrived at just the right time to improve Star Fragment vehicles. Wow, that looks beautiful, man. Look at that. Like, what do you even call this? this? Is vision 4 of 19 yellow rubber ducks light sails. The stars are quantum linked to the wagon wheels either side of the fan stacks. Q linking Wait, the stars are a part of it? Pattern uninterrupted by other parts. And Divlog has built something similar and implemented it into his wow. mobile bike design. The gimbal approach gives you a full 360 rotation of the star fragments. Nah, bro. Like, bro, some of you engineers, you bro, I need to work for NASA or something like that, bro. This is crazy. That's crazy. That that looks really nice. I can't lie. Wait, what did that? What does that mean? This is don't judge his uh -oh. take on an auto attack drone, and it's Ooh. pretty effective. Bro, what is that? Freeze frame. This is going around just just freezing everybody. Wait, does he have a sword behind him as well? So whenever he freezes him, he 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 cuts him. And then he cuts him with the sword. Okay, that's crazy. Like attack drones before it, it uses a fan on the back of a construct head so it always flies towards enemies. It's also using a frost emitter on the front to freeze enemies in place while it stabs with the Gerudo claim wow. used with the silver line or That is very smart. That's very smart. Uh oh. Uh oh. Freeze frame! Oh, snap! Oh my god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He started, he started, he started laughing, thought he was looking away. No, buddy, you're not going to get away, buddy. Star Wars fans, listen up. Hey. Da -da -da. Okay. Bro, oh, no, that's crazy. Bro, that is crazy, bro. Thanks so much for watching, oh, guys. Oh, man. Comment down below. What do you guys think about... I just know, what was your favorite clip, bro? Comment down below. What was your favorite clip? That last one was absolutely... Bro! Most of y'all need to be NASA engineers, bro. Ship us to Jupiter ASAP. Other than that, I'll see you guys for the next I'll see you guys for the next I'll see you guys for another one. Um, and peace out.